The Appalachian Wireless Holiday Sale is going on now. Till the end of the year, visit us in store or reserve online for an unbelievable sale on the hottest devices. We know what you want for the holidays because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. As winter is quickly approaching, the cold can be dangerous not only to humans but to pets. We spoke to Johnson County Animal Shelter President Lisa Trusty Roberts on ways to keep your pets safe this winter. There's a couple things you can do. Um, you want to make sure if you have outside, uh, keep have your animals outside for at any length of time to always make sure that they have proper shelter. Uh, make sure that they have that their water uh, is fresh not frozen. If you want to make sure that you always use straw in dog houses, not blankets. Those blankets become wet and they become hard and they provide no warmth whatsoever to the animals. And if it's really too cold for you to be outside, it's really too cold for them to be outside. So if you have the means when it gets, you know, below freezing and you can bring them in, of course, we would always advocate for that, for you to bring in your animals. In addition to keeping animals safe, another issue facing shelters during the holiday season is Christmas pets. Shelters see a large increase in return pets during January due to improper planning when gifting an animal. We see uh, animals that are adopted, both cats and dogs are adopted during, you know, Christmas is Christmas presents and stuff like that, but then they come back to the shelter and we see an increase in our numbers after Christmas. And it's really sad to see that. Just make sure that the that it'll be a good fit for the home as far as temperament in the home. If you have other animals, make sure that it's a dog that's suited to your lifestyle. Like if you are a family that really just likes to veg out on the couch and chill, you probably wouldn't want a really, you know, active dog. Um Whereas if you're an active family and you like to go hiking and, and do things like that, you'd want to find a breed or a, a dog that would suit that type of lifestyle. Johnson County Animal Shelter is currently over capacity. If you are interested in adopting or donating, go to Johnson County Animal Shelter on Facebook. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.